draw the patient's hand on a paper towel and make a pattern of the orthosis, which is then traced onto the thermoplastic material. Place the material briefly in the hot water to soften prior to cutting out the pattern. After cutting out the pattern, place the material back in the hot water to completely soften and activate. The thermoplastic is softened by heating at a temperature of 65 degrees Celsius or 149 degrees Fahrenheit. Remove the heated orthosis from the water bath with two hands and dry briefly on a towel to remove excess hot water. The patient's hand is positioned with the forearm supinated and the elbow supported on the table. The thumb and fingers remain in a relaxed position as possible. Place the orthosis over the patient's hand, wrist and forearm, letting gravity assist. Stretch the material onto the first web space so that it conforms and offers support to the thumb and index finger. Smooth the material down the forearm, stretching it slightly to help it conform. Do not pinch tightly in any one spot to avoid fingerprints and pressure points. Flip the patient's hand into pronation to check the alignment on the dorsal side. Let the material harden in the desired position. Mark the trimming edges along the borders of the orthosis. This can be done both inside and outside the orthosis. Remove the orthosis from the patient and trim, leaving a nice, smooth edge. Briefly heat the proximal edge of the orthosis and slightly flare away this edge with the fingers. Check the fit of the orthosis on the patient and note for correct positioning of the wrist and fingers. Mark the placement of the Velcro loop straps. Velcro loop straps can be attached directly to the thermoplastic material. Orfit Colors NS has a coating which must first be removed by scraping with scissors. Prepare the Velcro loop straps. Heat each spot with a heat gun briefly. Make sure not to overheat the material as it will lose its shape. Firmly press the Velcro loop strap into the heated thermoplastic. Repeat for the additional straps. Heat a small scrap of thermoplastic material with the heat gun until melted and press into the hole of the Velcro loop strap for a decorative button. Apply adhesive backed Velcro hook on the opposite side of the orthosis. Make sure this hook stays in place by dry heating this adhesive and also by dry heating the thermoplastic material. Place the orthosis back on the patient to check the fit and trim the straps. The orthosis should secure the wrist in slight extension and the thumb in wide abduction while allowing the fingers to rest in slight flexion. Using Orfit Colors NS in all color choices allows you to make bright and bold therapeutic orthoses which your patients will enjoy wearing.